it's another another what, Tuesday. Is Tuesday. it Tuesday today? Hey. Oh, that means another normal world. Uh, my name is Quarter Black Garrett, and with me today, co-hosting, really, the real host of the show, Austin Anderson. Welcome back. Oh no 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 <laughs> no 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 no! They mistakenly <laughs> cut to Dave. Not yet. This is uh, my name is Austin. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And this this is my chair and my show. It is now. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> you've already seen it. Uh, coming to us remotely from a private jet going out of the U.S. right now is Dave Landau. Welcome, Dave. Yes. Oh. I've just left P. Diddy's. <laughs> uh, I've been marked safe. Okay. Um, yes. No, I'm here in Detroit. I uh, apologize to the fans out there. I got in a car accident yeah. and uh, my car has been totaled, so I had to do a bunch of insurance crap, and I did not expect to be here for an extra amount of time. <sighs> that sucks, man. We have. The I'm video. glad you're okay, though, dude. Dave, yeah, I, I, w- I bet that P Diddy's house does have doors like that, though. Like how behind you, just doors everywhere where his victims try to leave, but they can't because yeah. it just goes to another room. Yeah. This one you actually have to pick. And depending on which one you pick, oh, the oh cu- boy, Austin. Cuba's Cuba Gooding Jr.'s behind one of the doors. You don't Gooding know if you're yeah. gonna get Diddy or Daddy. Oh, <laughs> who do you think That's is right. who do you think's rougher, Diddy or Daddy? Oh, Daddy. <laughs> Daddy's behind number one, and Diddy's <laughs> behind number two. And they're the same room. And you don't want goes into the same room. Yeah. It does, Makes yeah. Sense. There's really no barrier. There's yeah. just two doors to a monster. <laughs> uh, hey, a also today, monster. as uh, as usual, Angela. Oh, hi. Hey, Angela. Hi. How you doing? I got, I yeah, am. I got you. Thank you. Oh. Stop. <laughs> okay. Well, while we're doing it, just keep it. I'm actually. I'm just listening to the noise go through the microphone into my headphones now. It's a little bit of a claps feedback. for me. Uh, hey, yeah, let's go right into it. Uh, over the weekend, Monday, uh, P. Diddy, Puffy, Combs, Sean, his, uh, two of his houses, actually, one on the West Coast, one on the East Coast, got raided by the National Homeland Security. Uh, they had, they had a warrant for his home, but not for an arrest. And, uh, what, Angela, did you, what was the, what was the reasoning? It's, uh, he's well, okay. thought to have run a, a well, he's facing Sex four, trafficking? four lawsuits, yeah, um, claiming he raped or sexually assaulted several alleged victims over the past few <sighs> decades. The reason it's happening now is because there's this law that's supposed to be going into place that kind of stops the statute of, limitation, statute of limitations. So they got to like run this in yeah. pretty quickly. There's also limitations to some statues. Go on. <laughs> there are many. <laughs> <The> size. <laughs> um, but size apparently, is one. Mm-hmm. Shape. Uh, shape. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Dave, how did we not know? How did we not know that Puff Daddy was going to be like this? Because, you know, he was such a big deal when we were in middle school. And we should have known when he came out in white linen and it flowing. And he was <laughs> singing about how he missed that big fat guy. Yeah. That, like, he yeah. was the, well, he was a grown all, man making big... uh, them call him daddy. <laughs> His bad boys call him daddy. <laughs> <laughs> and we well, thought it was normal. Do we have the the video of him? We, we played this last time we talked about this. Him and uh, the Beebs. We I know we don't. <laughs> it's, it's in the file. It's in the file. You should have said something. Man, I, I find posted it. it in the thing. Um, is the big the big fat man though? Let's come on. Biggie, yeah. greatest one of the greatest rappers of all time, which is why Diddy allegedly had him killed. I was gonna say. And he was the they, bad A lot man. of people think it. He produced a lot him all the of way. people think it. Yeah, and he was a far better rappy than P. Diddy. So was Mace. And uh, I, Mace, I think, has been Mark safe. Uh, but yeah, it, I, I don't know. It's it's creepy. Like he's he he started white parties. Wasn't he the guy who started saying, hey, we're, let's wear all white on a boat that was wasn't that a clan? Well, it basically, well, he did that in the music videos. He was always in a yacht. He was always in right. white linen. He was always making grown men call him daddy. And he called them his bad boys. And we thought it, we strange. thought everything was normal. <laughs> I do have a, a, the video in question. Yeah, why oh, let's we roll it. It's okay. I don't know. Roll it. We should have known. <laughs> what was that? Uh-oh. Do you want me to say what they're saying? 
Yeah, my name Pete. He's saying, what a disaster. He's saying, yo, this little. <laughs> he's saying I. He's saying I had to turn his hat around because as the brim of his hat came bumping my stomach. Giving custody, you know, he signed the usher. Uh, I, I had legal guardianship of Usher when, when you know, he, he did his first album. I did Usher's Turned him album. out. I don't really, I don't have legal guardianship of him, but for the next 48 hours, he's with me. So, um, so yeah, he about to get raped. Full, but Allegedly. Full crazy. <laughs> going crazy. Justin, going crazy. White 48 part. hours. So what's the wood for it behind him? That does, that's know, not fire making. It's just wood. rustic. Body. Just a rustic. Dude, uh, that guy, that a, video is so up. weird. He grabs Justin Bieber. He's like, here's your car. When you turn 16, we're going to get you a yeah. mansion. It's like this dude. Bieber's face the whole time. He's like, what's going on? Who's what? Huh? <laughs> he's like legal custody. Huh? What do you, where's my mom? Hours. Where's my mom? Mom? <laughs> where'd, where'd my, where'd my, my mom leave that? me with Usher? And now, now a guy I have to yeah. call daddy. Where's Papa Usher? That was bad enough. Usher, Usher, Usher. Where's Papa Usher? Did, do you think he got? You think he got Usher too? Because he he found him when he was young as well. Legal guardianship is all. Yeah, yeah. They they used to Usher slept in his bed and they used to eat sleepovers. Oh, they used to eat cereal in the morning and wrestle each other for wow. it in linen. That's some weird shit. Yeah. I want a Charlie Usher's Murphy style story about too. that. You did? You heard that? What? what? Usher does. Yeah, Usher's got the herp dogs. You can look it up. Oh, yeah, he gave it to people. He was like, you can get my herpes. And Little John's like, yeah. <laughs> Little John was always in the room <laughs> going, yeah, herpes. Herp, 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 herp. And you DNA track that back <laughs> to P. Diddy? Like the P. Diddy herp? Maybe that's what Homeland oh, Security man. is doing. That's the statute of limitation it could right be there. The Diddy strain. Yeah. <laughs> the Diddy strain. Oh, I bet there is. Think it makes you a little think? puffy. <laughs> that's it. Swollen. Monster's ball. It's the yeah. monster's ball that's right. strain. Yeah. Make me feel yeah. good. He wasn't in that part, but that's no, the no. only thing I remember about that movie. We, sh we should have wrote off P. Diddy when he, when he used uh, the police as a, as a song. Why did we do whatever he bad. said? He It'll was like, drop. I'm Puff Daddy, I'm P. Diddy. We went along with it all. We yeah. called him what he wanted to be called. It's our fault. We played the game. That is odd to use the police in a song that misses your friend when the police have not solved your friend's murder. <laughs> yeah, you know, maybe he was leaving breadcrumbs, you know? Whoa, man. That's what it is. That's what it is. I think we need an expert in here to talk that, about You're it. right. Hmm. I am one. Hip-hop oh, yeah. 90s, let's <laughs> there you go. go. He'll be like, he's like, I'll be missing you. If you play that record backwards, it says, I shot you, motherfucker. It's a, yeah. It's, a, <laughs> it's like Led Zeppelin. It, it, yeah, you play it it's backwards. It's how the lights. It's not, I'll be missing you. how I the lights you. are timed. I shot your it's big ass because I wanted your fame. SUV. <laughs> what do you guys make of him uh, getting out of town? Oh, yeah, he's leaving. He went for, uh, they tracked his private plane from L.A. to Florida and then into the Bahamas. And so, Tigua. And then landed in Tigua, which has no extradite policy, no uh, treaty with America. I hope Kanye West oh. is with him and they I mean, crash into the ocean. <laughs> Together. The yeah. Bermuda like Triangle. Yeah. yeah. Like into the Bermuda Triangle. Did you say and then in... they're just in an endless cycle of blowing each other. Yeah. They would love that, though. That would hardly <laughs> be punishment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did you say he's in Cuba? And no. Tigua. Tigua. <laughs> Literally oh, never heard of this place in my life. They don't have an now. extradition system with the U.S., so... Probably because they're not real. Is that in the Caribbean? Yeah. I don't think I've been it's there. the Caribbean. <laughs> been through there it's, once. You've heard sort of, of fire the pirate. festivals. Oh, yeah, so. you've heard of Johnny Depp, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's where, the, it's where they <laughs> had fire festivals, so nobody got in trouble. <laughs> yeah, they couldn't sue. <laughs> <laughs> it's why he knew right to go there. He's like, let's go to where we're going to have yeah. music festivals. <laughs> <laughs> my, my boy Ja Rule, he told me about it. Ugh. Yeah, wow. he, weird yeah, scenario he, of circumstances. I, uh, so I mean, he's guilty. I mean, why? Like, why would you why run, would you, dude? Yeah, if you didn't, you have left anything. your sons. Yeah, his sons he were taken sons. in. His sons were taken in. Yeah, he's like, them. he's like, they ain't mine. They're male <laughs> prostitutes. I'm out. Peace. <laughs> I just have custody of them. I'm out. I don't know. Man, that that house is ripe for squatters right now in L.A. Bro, yeah, have That's you heard about place that? To go, Austin. What? The, the squatting epidemic. It's actually in in uh, a lot of places across the U.S. Like. Like CrossFit? Uh, uh, yeah. How long do also I have to freaking... squat? <laughs> so you it's just mine. roll up into an empty house and say you live there, and they can't legally kick you out. 
I can do that anywhere. You anywhere have to you be want, there basically. for uh, well, a certain amount of time. Well, I could do that to it. Like, there's a lot of abandoned houses where I live. Oh yeah, I could, I could take over so live? many. Dave, what if you you could? You, there's a lot of houses up there. That's free real estate, man. I live. Oh, you the, can just go in. I mean, if you want it. In Detroit. <laughs> in oh, Detroit, yeah. that's true. Yeah, I it's already like in, in L.A. Though, like, yeah, you got you can go into the house and live there for a while. There's a couple mansions in Beverly Hills right now that people just rotate living in. Yeah. That are just completely abandoned. Like some guy's house is just lived in by squatters. They arrested like where you a live, lady. Austin. They arrested a lady, the homeowner of the, of the house, rolled up and was like, "Hey, I'm trying to clean this up to get it ready for renters to come in," and uh, the people wouldn't leave. And then the cops came and arrested her. Yeah, they're lucky. Right. She's lucky they didn't shoot her like she deserved. <laughs> remember when the <laughs> LAPD? You, you, remember when the LAPD <laughs> used to beat you half to death for no reason? <laughs> Now they're just like, you can have the house. When you have people yeah. like Rampart. <laughs> like, now they just let you get away with everything. Like, dude, it's crazy. That's not, like, they need to go back a little bit to shutting off body cameras. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I just did a show for a bunch of police. Really? Yeah. Like a corporate gig? Yeah. Was they were, scary? Yeah, like I almost like didn't like go in. Knew. I came up there. I, I just had... PTSD from all the times I was arrested. Not as many as Dave, but enough to not want to go in. Dave, have you ever done one? Like a policeman's ball Oh, yeah, or something? done a lot of police charities. Yeah, yeah. I've balled a policeman. <laughs> <laughs> How does I've the material also, change? Um, no, but I, yeah, do you have to change it for the crowd? <laughs> you know? Oh, I, I pretend to be material? more on the side of the cops. <laughs> yeah, you gotta do it. You're just like, do, fuck do, the do police! Blue. Run off. <laughs> 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 no, I, uh, I've done, yeah, police, firemen, all the all that jazz. All the sexy uh, occupations? Yes, well, just all the, very sexy. On, yeah. The firemen are the only ones that work out. That's well, they funny. have to. Yeah. You know, they're not, they don't have to. They're not really doing anything. They're just waiting for that bell to ring. Yeah. They got to go put out a fire. Big deal. What's up with the slide down that pole, too? Like, we have, <laughs> we have, we have stairs. Guys. Because Not they're fast enough. Because it's a, there's like a it's a boys club. Oh, oh, it's just for the fun. Yeah, it's a club. It's like you slap each other's asses. You slide the pole. All right. Maybe you drink too much one night, and then you use the pole <laughs> as a stripper pole. A little fucking and then, yeah, I see it. yeah, and then <laughs> all of a sudden, it's just a big. It's like the Spartans. They just fight fires oh, they, and do each other yeah. and leave their families. Because if you love your brother, then uh, you'll protect him. Yeah, oh, yeah, there's a reason. Yeah. So all the people I with feel like, like it takes 300 a while. tattoos, just know. Yeah. What takes a while? Well, it takes a while to get the, the engine ready, it seems, in the movies. Like, I feel like the pull is, well, I guess you don't want to stampede over each other on a stairwell. What yeah. I'm saying is they're heroes, so I'll yeah. just stop. Yeah, they are. My heroes. brother's uh, going to be a fireman. He's, he's passed all of his That's tests off. and everything. He's about to about to go to a firehouse. Yeah. I'll ask him about all the weird gay sex. Just because they're gay doesn't mean they can't be heroes. Remember yeah, that. True. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> <laughs> what, a, what, is the, what, what is the test? Yeah, what is the test? What, the fireman's test? They you just have to it. put out a fire? Oh, yeah, you yeah. have to go through the, the fireman's ca academy. Yeah, they so like... you learn all the, the stuff, <laughs> and then you put out a fire. and they're they like, yeah, you got George it. Foreman. How fast you can get undressed and dressed. Yeah, yeah. They time it. They have like a little ticker. Like, three seconds. Too long. Make yeah. sure yeah. you can handle that hose. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Holding it. Holding it. Spray each other down. Spray down. Good. <laughs> yeah. Wearing suspenders with no shirt on. They throw like they throw instead of like that chemical bath stuff, that powder that they throw, but they mm -hmm. practice with powdered sugar. Yeah. Yeah. So they, throw... <laughs> <laughs> they get yeah, sticky. They, they, a little they, sticky. They lick it off each other. It's a movie now. A sexy movie. Where Starring no all the Baldwin brothers. <laughs> all the Baldwin brothers. And call it Backdraft 2. Backdraft. That's a yeah. real movie. Uh, Neuralink. Hey, you guys ready to get uh, computer chips in your brain? I'm ready. Austin, are you going to get a computer chip? If Elon's like, hey, no. it does everything for you. You don't have to do anything. No, I I hate Elon's face. He looks like an alien. Looks I think a little he's weird. trying to go to Mars to find his ancestry. <laughs> well, he took to uh, Twitter in January to reveal that the company had impl implemented its first brain-computer interface. Uh, it's kind of scary. In the head of a human patient, that human patient, uh, actually, he went and used it to play Civilization VI all night long. He didn't with have his, to go sleep. With his brain plant? With mm -hmm. his brain implant, yeah. Which yeah. I think is like, hey, that's actually a good use. 
I'm starting to kind uh, of. What happened? I heard it. Does he not get tired anymore? No. No. Bad it's like the whole reason to sleep is because you're letting your brain rest. But if you're not using your brain. Well, I know that we have to dream or we die. Is that a thing? Yeah. I thought that was a movie. Father, father-in-law a, was oh, a sleep doctor. That explains how I feel. <laughs> yeah. So. <laughs> um. Yeah. So I think you have to sleep at some point, but right. the brain chip will make it so you. It's so it's like apparently it implanted helps. Adderall. Oh yeah. That sounds great. Could you like do, put on different modes, like sleep psychedelic mode? mode? You can just like woo, see weird stuff in the, in the know, ground moves. But Screw they did it. take to Twitter to show off the moment that they made oh, yeah, the breakthrough moment. All right, I got to see this. Play it. It's coming. <laughs> did it work? Was Elon's Neuralink brain implant a success? A soaring success. Your vitals are normal, and the diagnostics show that the chip is active. How does it look? Can you see it? No. Oh, no. No, nope, uh, not at all. No. Nope. It, it's mm -hmm. barely noticeable. Cool. That's great. But now for the exciting part. Let's see if it actually works. On screen, you'll see three colored circles. Now, using only your mind, I want you to point at the red circle. Asian milk porn? What? I didn't think of that. Something must be wrong. No, according to the diagnostics, everything is functioning normally. Well, I didn't think about that. No worries. Let's bring the test back up and try again. This time, I want you to point at the blue circle. Taylor Swift nude AI images. Really, Dave? Same thing is happening again. I, I, I don't know why. I, I definitely didn't think about that. It's probably like reading your, your brain. Dave, be honest. You thought about that. I was not thinking about that. Wade's typing something. Yes, that is what I was thinking about. You, I was not. You were probably thinking about it, Lesbo. Wow. It's definitely working. The probe is blinking like crazy. What probe? I thought you said you couldn't see it. All right, all right. Never mind that. Let's try a different test. Uh, open the drawing program. Now, using only your thoughts, I want you to draw this figure. Okay. Remarkable. He's not drawing the triangle, but whatever he is drawing appears to be far more intricate and complex. I think it's Anna and Elsa from Frozen, and Real. they're topless. Great. Real nice, Dave. That's a children's cartoon. I, it's, I didn't draw that. Come on, man. I watched that movie with my daughter. Now, how am I supposed to watch it without thinking of you, titty fucking Elsa and Anna? Your adopted daughter? Pervert. It's not true. I wasn't even thinking about that. Everything is working perfectly. You clearly thought about Elsa and Anna naked, just like you thought about Taylor Swift naked, just like you thought about Asian milk porn. I don't even like Asians. I'm a scientist. My wife is Asian. Oh yeah, what kind? North Korean. She's on podcasts telling stories that don't add up. Does she have white parents? She does. Okay, so she's just a white girl with smart eyes. Sky, where did we get so, that? Oh, come on. Nice day. Well, I, I don't... Guys, guys. Okay, just... What are you drawing now? What? A middle finger. Thanks, Dave. Okay, I did do that. So, one in ten. Yeah, this is totally different than the vaccine chip, all right? Elon's chip doesn't work, so I'm gonna take it out. You can't take it out! Why? It's permanent for the rest of your life. If you try to take it out, it'll fry your brain, like all those monkeys we tried it on first. The what now? You don't know about the monkeys? Uh-oh. Uh, now he's opening a Word document. Can't wait to see what he's thinking. Man, this scientist is a real D-bag, but the assistant is kind of hot. If she weren't such a bitch, I'd like to see her make out with Anna from Frozen. All right, shut it down. Clearly, this chip is a success, so tell Elon it works and get something to buy off Dave. Keep him quiet. Dave, for helping us with this experiment and for promising not to tell anyone about it, you're getting one of Elon's brand new Cybertrucks. Happy birthday. I want a Cybertruck? Cybertrucks look like a kid drew it. I want a Ford Raptor F-150 so I can get some puss. Wait, can I drive it with my mind? Go nuts. Sure. Yeah. Bury him with the monkeys. Okay, boss. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> hopefully that'll fix his crippling depression, you know, one day. One day. I think that chip was cool. One day. 
It was pretty cool. Did Have you, you seen one? <laughs> yeah. It works. Yeah. No, I'm not letting, I can't let anyone put chips in my brain. I think it's, yeah, it's a bridge too far. You it know? is. It's, um, I mean, the fact that like people are rooting for this or like think it's okay. Yeah. Like, we should have, so pi- we should have pitchforks and torches and we should, you know, burn Elon probably starting with <laughs> his hair plugs. Mm. Yeah. I don't feel You'll good about, about the, the whole chip. <laughs> it's not a good thing. Sorry. I was looking at no, something I shouldn't. Were you? Were you using the chip again? <laughs> no, I was just looking down. I, I get, I'm getting these texts, and I don't understand them. <laughs> what are they about? <laughs> what are they about, Dave? <laughs> I, uh, hey, I uh, I one of our friends, network. friends of the show, <laughs> he's been on the show before. He's a good guy. I don't think his we legally is Eric end. July. <laughs> and he is releasing his third campaign, Yaira. The uh, comic book story about uh, somebody that does uh, magic powers. Is that correct? That is correct. So yes. uh, go check it out. Eric July, he's a great dude. He This is like third campaign that's over a million. A uh, ton of people have been reading it. I haven't gotten it yet. I wish I, I had like a fast track because I feel like we're friends, Like, but he didn't give me one. This is a great it is what it is. <laughs> what's, um, what's, it, what's it about? Uh, I see it's 90 pages. 90. The next one's 120. Okay. This one's nice. Like so you getting time. your money's worth, son. Oh, yeah. Getting your money's worth. It's going to answer some burning questions you have about the Puff Daddy herpes. That's a different lens. Oh, that's so <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> don't. don't do that. that's hey, go check it out right on. now before it ends. Uh, <laughs> and then after that, it's uh, you, you can't get it. So ripaverse.com slash Yaira. And that's how it's pronounced, not Yara. Do it. Do it. Yaira? Yaira. Yaira. Don't ask me. Yaira. Gotcha. <laughs> Yaira. 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 Written by the Saska sister, some actual Yaira. professional comic book industry professional writers. So, Who's your favorite hero in the comic book sphere right now? Because I know it's all been ruined. Oh, fuck. I don't even read comic books anymore. I stopped. I, I like the Punisher until they remake it with a diverse woman. They did kill him. <laughs> They killed the Punisher and he came back with a different skull because the come back, thought it was yeah. uh, too uh, conservative. We'll come back as Lenny Kravitz. Oh, we really don't know what that, that is. Yeah. Yeah. Why would it's he? Like a mystery. Why would? Why would that be conservative? Because it's like marine like. Uh yeah. I don't mean a lot biology, of... like biology. <laughs> like fish and shit. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, I don't mean like fish. No. Uh, because uh, yeah, like the uh, military took on the emblem a lot and they used it on. Uh, their trucks and they got tattoos of it and they put it on on their um, so the military stole it basically and they think it's uh it's stolen valor stolen i have From i punisher i have it as a tramp stamp tattoo oh, that's how you know business yeah like oh he's just says frank here. castle though it's just a coincidence yeah <laughs> in old english <laughs> yeah it just says francis <laughs> castle and right now it's all like <laughs> blending <laughs> together because i got it when i was 18 yeah it's all like it was my first tattoo yeah. frank castle dang <laughs> Yeah, he paid for it. He's like, I'll get you a tattoo, but it has to be my name. And you're like, okay, that's cool. Mr. Castle. Yeah. It actually says Frank Camden. I'm like, oh, damn. Uh, no, it's, it's the Punisher. How would you know? It's back there. I couldn't know that. It doesn't matter. Who's going to see it? Besides yeah. me. Yeah, it's always dark at the park. I wanted to give it a... <laughs> Oh, man. There's like Frank people Castle. that go to parks Did you have at night. Yeah, just pull their parks? pull their penis out in a park. Yeah. Those, those. There's this guy that used to harass oh, us at shoot. the park when we were kids, and he called himself the magician. Oh, that's a guy. Did he make kids disappear? Mm, he would just... <sighs> Listen. <laughs> He's like behind this sheet. Just runs to his car. He would You're wear like, a cape. Oh, a very good trick. We would I hang out there. Her. Yeah. Yeah. We would hang out there like late at night, like in high school, like twelve to two or yeah. so. And he'd always show up, and he had a cape, and he'd just stare at you from what across the, the park. And he, one of our friends went up to him one time and was like, "What's up with you, man?" He goes, "I'm the magician." <laughs> Damn. Where'd you grow up? Here, the- <sighs> Dallas. <laughs> Angela's stories Texas. are an endless. That is terrifying. <laughs> that's almost uh, that's yeah. creepier than uh, when Dave almost got picked up and molested and killed, but they had the wrong kind of candy. 
Oh, oh. that's a true story. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, he offered me, he offered me, uh, good and plenty. Uh, <laughs> no, not good and plenty. It was candy corn. And I was like, what? And then I went back inside and I got my dad and the guy was gunning it through the parking lot. He didn't even have a van. It was like a Buick. Was he wearing a cape? Did the magician travel? Called, him, called himself Tricks. <laughs> I never did that, but I once I found a baby. Sorry, go ahead. I found... By the way, Angel, your stories, the more you talk about, the more I'm going to figure you out. <laughs> They're wild. When that was I... a dark thing to share. When I was eight, my cousin and I found a baby bird and it, you know, it, Glad was, it was a bird. It was without its mom. So we nursed it back to life. Okay. And then we went to go set Holy it nipple. free. And this guy <laughs> drives up the street, and there was a cul-de-sac on both sides, on the top of the hill and the bottom of the hill. I lived on the bottom. And he missed the bird, and he turned around and came down and missed it again, and then turned around and ran over our baby bird and just looked at us and laughed and oh. drove off. Evil. That's, is that wild? That's crazy. That's so sad, man. This was the 90s, too. Me and, yeah, that's not cool at all. Where'd you, yeah, you, you're, was it you and... Adam Devine? Yeah, yeah. I, that was uh, later on in life. That was... Um, oh, I thought he bird. wasn't the one that killed the bird? No, no. This was <laughs> me and my cousin. We were only eight. Adam Devine, I mean, someone... I mean, he did get hit by a cement truck, but I don't think that guy was busting you. He's trying to hit him. I feel like if you did a better job at nursing it back to health, it would have flown away. Yeah, <laughs> I, I obviously failed. <laughs> yeah, that's really what it was. Damn. He did get hit by a cement truck. <laughs> Was yeah. it front or back? He uh, he got hit. Get this. This is this is how awesome the government is. He got hit in um, one county, and then his body was flown into another county. So then they fought about who was going to pay him the uh, money. It's like a Kyle Rittenhouse <laughs> situation. Because, yeah, because he got hit one place, but his ra like just ravaged body fell on oh. another county. Wow. So they thought about it's it. It's funny because yeah, they figured when my it out. Mom like, what, was there her precedent house now? Was on two city lines, and they both had no problem trying to claim taxes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. Either not pay Dude, money or such pay money. Scumbag. Yep. Hey, uh, normal world. We like to give you the news, and uh, we're going to update you on this story, this ongoing story of the princess being kidnapped and disappeared. Uh, turns out she wasn't. She has cancer. Sorry, sorry for all oh. the <laughs> jokes that we had there. Uh, we may have been off. Yeah. She uh, turns out. That, Unless yeah. this is still part of the conspiracy. Oh, man. We're back out. in now. We're back yeah. in. What I got to say is how many women want to be a princess now? Yeah. That's a good point. I'm yeah. Because they're always like, it's I want to be a princess. Well, guess what? They also get cancer and slowly die. Yeah. And they're inbred. Or they... That's a good point. What if you have to, like, would you take the trade? Oh, to be a princess for a few years, and then you just slowly yeah. decay? Yeah, oh, to be a princess for Ooh. a night, but slowly <laughs> die. I don't so, know. Angela, would you do it? Cancer. No. No? No. Not that royal family. Yeah, that one seems to be really power. fucked up. I don't, yeah. I don't think oh, there's weird. any royal family that... You know, you would want to be part of. Like a Rothschild. Yeah. What about one of those? I mean, like, look maybe, at P. Maybe. Diddy's, like, royalty. Because I'm going to die anyway. <laughs> Probably soon or Might as well later. die rich. Yeah. And you'd get a cool funeral. That's true. Everybody That's true. would, you know. A whole freaking country shut down. Yeah. I yeah. realized they how I wanted later. my funeral. How do you want it? I want, I'm going to have fake tits put in with a forest, <laughs> forest open cast. Okay. And then I'm going to be dressed very well, but I'm going to have my eyeballs bugging out. <laughs> and then the song that will play on the loop... <laughs> It's Betty Davis eyes oh, <laughs> over man. and over again. <laughs> so everybody who comes in is forced to look at <laughs> my my new tits that I got since I was deceased <laughs> and the bug the bug eyes I have while Betty Davis eyes plays. <laughs> and then before everybody leaves, the door will shut and glitter oh. and rain will come from the ceiling so it'll create like a glitter sludge 
and ruin everyone's clothes yeah. and they will be upset <laughs> with me forever and they'll be like first of all i brought my like dave's tit dave had new tits <laughs> and he had betty davis eyes playing on a loop <laughs> and all my dress clothes are ruined and why it's gonna and be like i really so wish scarred. you would have left me something <laughs> instead of wasting all <laughs> that money on, on this new tits for it, all the money will go to that and if uh, also the casket will be obscenely low rent. <laughs> like I will have it will be made of particle board, and then I will I will paint it myself. <laughs> and then the have like I got ready. From, and then have your wife co- like collecting money to pay for your new new tits. Be oh, like yeah. so. There's a jar. Right. It's like yeah, we're in debt. Dave's tits. Like we we still got to pay him off. <laughs> You could put the, you could put yeah. the casket instead of laying down, put it up like this, like they did in the, like the nineteen early nineteen oh, hundreds. Dude, it's open casket, and there's like a top hat that's sitting upside down, right in front of it. When you walk up, you just. And then I got it now. Oh, I the, like that. the glitter before the glitter falls from the sky, your tits burst. Oh, and glitter oh. shoots out, boom, boom, and catches them by surprise on oh. their faces. That's a good idea. And then and then when the they're Gallagher like, ah, show. and then it starts raining glitter. That's it. That's even better. That's what yeah. you gotta do. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. So there'll be glitter tits that are yeah, put in, but yeah. nobody will know. While it plays Betty Davis eyes, but everybody will be like, This is a <laughs> oh, bit much. I don't then, know why he wanted right it. Right on cue. And then your wife gets on the mic and says, Hey, those tits that just exploded, they the nipples were made of solid gold and they're worth sixty thousand dollars each. And then everybody's so covered in everybody. glitter, <laughs> fighting each Rambling. other to find your gold nipples. Right. And then when they find them, they realize they're just candy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Rap. gotcha. Rap. No, and not even that. Dude. Like you're not even dead. It's not even chocolate. It's candy corn. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm not dead. And you're I wearing a true disappointment. The song changes. Yes. What's that? You're wearing a wedding dress. <laughs> I think I'm going to get that tattoo on my. Yes, I'll be in a wedding dress. <laughs> I'm gonna get that tattoo of you with dead with the tits covering my Frank uh, Camden tattoo. <laughs> I think you should. Like, I just felt like yeah. that's the best thing to do is if you're gonna have a funeral where it's like if you're not gonna cremate me, I want you to ruin a day for everyone. <laughs> where they all like have that, to ask yeah. why you did this, but no one can know until they get there, and they'll be like, "Is that?" Dave in the casket with is the it? huge tits, and you're like, "Yeah, that's him." Did he? So when did he get those? That. <laughs> yes, is alive. Died. So this is how this is how I would want my funeral to be in Nebraska. There's a there's a creek, like a river. It's the Elkhorn River. It's just a real dirty, nasty river that's not very big. Mm. And I want to be put like on a canoe with like a bunch of timber and all that. Yeah, and then they just like push the canoe down. And shoot a flaming arrow Viking at it. And then, yeah, and I just burst into flames. But then I would just probably hit the bank. And then set the bank on fire. Yeah, and then it would just be my burning body in this yeah. dirty river. But it would be pretty cool. I did that with my pet fish. I like it. I put them on a little thing. It's not as great as yours, fire. though. It was nice. I had to read. I got to. Th- you, you, well, maybe you if gave I get. a Viking funeral to a fish? Hold on. Yeah, I did. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> I just got to think. I what think I should get tits, too. It's a goldfish? It was a little goldfish. You should get tits. He died. I put him on a little Viking funeral thing, and I set him on fire with a little bic lighter. Did you give him tits? I didn't give him tits. Wow. No, that would have been uh, that would have been the choice. <laughs> you oh. should have taken his gills. He had the bug eyes, though. He did have the bug eyes before he was old enough to make the decision for himself. <laughs> it wasn't okay back then. It was the two thousands. <laughs> now I'm just thinking 2000s. about Garrett. Like if he just had like his. Big tits. Where he lived. No, it's just a bunch of dead fish that you've experimented on that all have fake tits. <laughs> so you just have like rotting fish. With like the... Frankenstein. Yeah, you like have this little fish with tits. <laughs> you're just, you're a it's taxidermist. Just have you seen Tusk? That only puts <laughs> yeah. tits on animals. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's just a very niche skill, but I'm very good at it. For a long time, I've practiced and practiced. <laughs> Put them in the pile. Fish tits. <laughs> uh, Rebel. Yeah, you just throw them in the. Rebel Wilson. Sorry. Oh yeah. Uh, you you brought this story up. I don't. Rebel Wilson, the comedian, the the British comedian. She's Australian. Uh, is she she Australian? used to be heavy when she was in. Uh, I can't tell. They all sound weird. In Pitch Perfect, but now she's thin. She's yes. thin and tall. She lost weight like Al Roker. Yes. Yeah. It looks weird. I'm g- good for her though. Good for her, but it does look a little weird. No, she looks pretty um, good. That's you know like uh what, what there was a black singer she was in um. What is that movie? 
Do you know what I'm talking about? She, Sister she, Act. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that black Timeless singer classic. got bigger. <laughs> the Wiz. <laughs> no, but she also lost a lot of weight. Oh, the purple people. That's it. Color purple. The, the color purple, yeah. The, nope, that's still, that's the same one you were talking about before. That's just Oprah. Do you mean yeah. the original? <laughs> Not Oprah. It's a whoopee. Talk about whoopee there. Well... What's Anyways, the okay, what's the story? What is Rebel Wilson? What's happening with her? She's, she's made a memoir. She re- she's writing a memoir. <laughs> R-E-S-P-C-T? <laughs> yes. I and, think uh, she played her. She played her in a movie. I Who think she looks, she looks cute. Oh, she looks yeah, good, she yeah. Looks good. Oh, Adele? You talking about Adele? Is that Adele right Adele. there? That's not Adele. That's not. It's not Adele, but she could play Adele. Oh, she could. Look at the shoulder I mean, the Adele shoulder could also width, play Adele. The wingspan. Get them shoulders. So basically, she's writing this memoir. And she said, oh, uh, there's this asshole I mentioned in my book. And he, this asshole is trying to get my book shut down. And then she came forward and said it was Sasha Baron Cohen. What? Because allegedly. No way that makes sense. He said on a set of a movie that she should take all her clothes off. It would be so funny if she got naked. And then he was like, put your finger in my butt. It would be so funny. <laughs> <laughs> what movie was this? What's going Like, why can't what people just in? make art without... Well, Sasha got fingered? He's trying. <laughs> <laughs> no one can make art anymore without having to do something with the butthole. It always goes back Oh, I guess they've never been able to. I think that's Since the is. foundation of Hollywood, they were like... It's built on butts. Yeah. We built this I town on holes. We built this town Ever since on the, the innocent butt. That's what Dan Ever Snyder's since, trying to uh, say. You know, he's just making great, yeah, great the, kids uh, content, and uh, you know, allegedly touching people in the buttholes, like <laughs> Sasha. But even back to the days of like the Warner Brothers when they first came out, they were like, "Why don't you show me your butthole and get in the pictures?" And then <laughs> right. a lot did. Yeah, and they did it. Some did. I mean, Marilyn Monroe did good, but I mean, not everybody got to be Marilyn Monroe. Some just got their butthole fingered. Wait, are you saying that Marilyn Monroe didn't? Because I thought she did. No, I'm sure she, hey, I think she did. The one person. Tragically, pers- many times. The one person that was like, you will not touch my butthole is the Black Dolly. They're like, all right. <laughs> oh, and then they, they just f- cut her up oh, and put yeah. her in a field. And they're like, yeah, yeah that's where they're going to find you in six different places. On each county. Turns out it was Sasha Baron Cohen. You're gonna be a star, kid. That... <laughs> mm-hmm. You know they never found who killed her or her butthole. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fucking mystery, dude. They're never gonna <laughs> find it out. All the people that have ever had anything to do with it, completely dead. <laughs> or her butt. It was her true. You can't arrest. <laughs> you can't really arrest anybody no now. Butthole, I mean, it really no is a crime. cold case. <laughs> no what what year yeah, was it in? Yeah. Was was Warren Betty there, alive then? <laughs> I think he was like a Warren child. Ba- at that time. I don't think Warren Beatty was alive. Yeah, this was Maybe in the forties, yeah, I think. Yeah. <laughs> it was a th- I think it was even earlier than that. I think it was the thirties. I don't know why I want to throw. I'm gonna guess. Warren you Bay. know what what it is. <laughs> I'm gonna. <laughs> Angela knows what it is. Well, yeah, I can't because he was in Bonnie and Clyde or Bugsy. Yeah, like, it's got to be Warren Beatty. <laughs> yeah, it's got to be. Remember when he was in that was movie wrong, Angela, was right. with uh, where he was the politician and he was like rapping. Bullworth. With, yeah, Bullworth. <laughs> with Holly Berry. Yeah, I don't know that movie. It's very racist if you go back and watch it. Kind of hard to watch. Really? <laughs> it really upset a lot of people. Yeah, he says a lot of bad things about chicken and drinking 40s. And uh, I don't know. It didn't connect the way that I think the writer <laughs> thought it all, would. All I remember is him like dancing with a 40. Mm. Yeah, he and dances like, with a 40. I gotta he's get, got like I gotta the, get with the street toughs. And this had Halle Berry in it? Yeah. What year Halle was Berry's this? In it, it's like and, the 90s? It was 99, I think, 98. And he's like, basically, he's a politician who says, he snaps and says all this racist stuff. You mean like a politician? And then Halle Berry protects him by dressing him like a member of Cypress Hill and sneaking him around the hood. (laughs) I have to watch. Oh, God. They're like, just let him have it. He did Dick Tracy (laughs) with all the weird foreheads and the Madonnas. Hide you. It's like a. uh, fuck, I'm so bad at this right now. <laughs> like Malibu's Most Wanted. It kind of, except uh, Malibu's Most Wanted was very aware of itself. And see how I've he's seen coming this out poster. Like the thug. Yes, I've yeah. seen coming this poster for mouth. sure. Yes. That's yeah, what it's like it didn't, uh, people liked it when it came out. It was like, it was actually a critical success. And then a couple years later, Dude, people were like, this is It's like uh, Dude, My Fair Lady. Really with it was. But, you know. That's like how we got hypnotized why we thought it was okay to call Puff Daddy a daddy. 
It was like the same thing, and then we snapped out of it. It just took us a lot longer with the Puff Daddy. That's true. We thought it was thuggish to be like, bad boy for life. And you're like, yeah, bad boy. Bad, 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 yeah. bad boy. boy. You're awesome. so bad <laughs> and naughty. Bad. <laughs> What are the lyrics? <laughs> bad, bad, what bad, bad, bad these underage Ooh. kids? And I'll film you. Yeah. Call me daddy. What makes you so bad? Ooh. Ooh, all of like, the pedophilia. Wow, I'm surprised this is weird. Yeah, I yeah, like I'm, it, I like it when they call big, you Big Papa. All that stuff. We shouldn't have been. I've never felt, felt right with the call me daddy kind of pillow talk. It's just strange. No. It's not oh. right. Just oh. un Unless you're uncouth. with your father. Well, it's just what? Let's not mention it then. In that <laughs> personal <case>. thing. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I don't. I don't. I don't have one. I don't have. <laughs> if you're with somebody else's dad, though, they could be like QB. Call me daddy, dude. Oh, you know, my son. You should find this clip of. <laughs> this is my one of my favorite things. Is uh, it was on the show. Tammy Faye wrote it. Um, or Tina Fey. The Pretty rock. The one that's, with that's a Kim, huge, Schmidt? huge cat. Kimmy, Kimmy, Kimmy Schmidt. Schmidt. Oh, Kimmy Schmidt. Yeah. There's a thing where there's a play called Daddy's Boy, and he's like, "I'm Daddy's boy. He's Daddy's Daddy's boy." It's the funniest. I think I, I, think I got it. Oh, play it if you can. I like how you can pull stuff up. It's so good. Hold on. Any? It's uh. We we gotta run. Daddy's boy. This is like recorded inside of He's got a daddy that he brings such joy. My daddy's tall and sweet like a candy cane. And when we walk down the street, we refuse to explain. How a daddy's boy. And the daddy's boy's daddy. And the daddy's boy's daddy's daddy. Could love each other so. And that's how they... They're on a yacht. <laughs> Wait, just, what was that? Oh, you gotta see the... <laughs> what was that last part? You gotta see the end. Was that like a televangelist? That was the... That's how Daddy's Boy... The guy who's explaining like the history of it, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. okay. Oh, like a Daddy's Boy classic movie. It's on as the crew refused to continue working on the production. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the daddy's boy's oh daddy's God. boy daddy. Tina Fey has a thing boy. about that. Then, oh, she's not in Arrested Development, but I was like, because they do the um, mother boy thing. Oh in yeah, that too, where it's like um, yeah. that. Yeah, <laughs> weird. Hey, Austin, thanks for it's being the host of this show. Yeah. Oh, I sorry, Dave. no, I, you know what? I Aww. I appreciate the. I got to do it. I miss Dave tremendously, but oh, me too. This this seat is feeling kind of nice after I got rid of all the pillows. There's a lot of pillows there. That's well, what hopefully it, my neck sustains. <laughs> <laughs> How was your neck, man? Actually, not good. I got to the doctor. You, you you have been pretty still, you know. You got to get that rubbed out, you know. Get a daddy. I'm <laughs> rub your neck. I'm gonna find a daddy. I'm gonna find two daddies and pay for extra oil. Yeah, there you go. Rub it up and like like, like use he the would mint. say. <laughs> you could probably get that done at um, White Castle. They'll just use the grease. Or in the park. After I can go to a few White Castles near here. I don't want to brag, but I could. And then go. I don't want to brag about diarrhea. I like to use the grease as massage oh, yeah. oil. <laughs> could you just give me a nice, just and a bucket. The... Back there, the Lord. <laughs> yeah, the Lord. <laughs> can I promote stuff? Yeah. Where, you, where can people to? see you? I, I want to promote some things after you. You you promote first, then. I just want to say you can go to austinanderson.net and... Um, Recently just made a, a show pilot for, um, it's kind of like Office-esque, and it's about two brothers it's fantastic. that oh, are playing in a church. Did you watch it? I did watch it. Oh, thank you. It's great, dude. Thanks. Yeah, I've got a lot of good feedback on it. So Wait, Where can we walk? Where Go to austinanderson.net. Go do it. Uh, Dave, where can people see you? This weekend I will be in Morris Plains, New Jersey at TIFF's. So if you want to swing by and mace me, uh, that's where I'll be because that happened. Uh, that happened to you? I'm not pregnant. No. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was Chrissy talking to like Chrissy. I was place. like, damn, you too? Yeah. yeah, it's the same place. And then I um, was just letting them know. <laughs> just <laughs> giving them the target. I'll be there wearing goggles, taking pictures after. 
And then, um, but yeah, that's a horrible thing to do to a pregnant woman, yeah. just so you know. And uh, the day after, I'll be uh, Easter Sunday, Zany's in Nashville. So come on out. I didn't know it was Easter when I took the gig. So let's try to fill the room, guys. <laughs> come on, Tennessee. Yeah, after you're here. Come out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Daddy yeah. needs a new car. <laughs> <laughs> you look I'm under so your seat, sad. find eggs. We need to pay for his tit job. Mm-hmm. His post mortem. Yeah. Yeah, you got it. Davis tits. <laughs> Davis. What are they rolling you in on? Like I like how maybe you're surrounded by like uh deli meats too. Oh, like oh, hanging oh, up like, like the kind nice of slab. Eat. Yeah, and like or like just like uh one of those boards, you know, yeah. the like charcuterie garnish. board. Mm. A little garnish on each side. Yeah, and cheeses. That'd be nice. <laughs> and it'll be like and Betty there's... Davis quotes playing while like to try the meats. Like, <laughs> yeah, go yeah. ahead, make a tur, make a turkey sandwich. <laughs> and if you're looking for respect, show business isn't the game for you. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff like that. Yeah, that's gonna be a beautiful event. I can't wait. Uh, hey, I'm you not, can find me uh, at my <laughs> personal channel and my Twitter feed, which is hopping right now. Uh, that's it. Uh, uh, I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow. Is it, do we have anything else we got hit before we go? No. No. All right. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Oh, p- right. Yep. How how you want your funerals planned? Oh yeah. In the, in the comments, comments. right do now. That. Do it. Do that. Oh yes. yeah, that would be sweet. How you want your funerals? Yeah, we want to read the best ones. We'll read the best ones tomorrow. We'll read them tomorrow. Because the end is coming. <laughs>